So the sounds of the spheres are frequencies, vibrations that come from the planets. The main planet that we hear, obviously, is planet Earth. But each planet has its own sound. These are frequencies that are not used in our normal music. We don't tune our pianos to them. We are, the concert pitch is not tuned to these sounds. But they're extremely healing sounds. And the most healing is the vibration of the earth. And we call that vibration OM. Have you ever heard of the word OM? Okay, so Pythagoras, who was the very first person who thought about this, was a mathematician who discovered the, um, all the geometric shapes and the relationship between the planets and sound and numbers. Have you ever taken geometry in school yet? No? Okay. Okay, so now NASA has also discovered that the planets make these sounds, which is very, very exciting. We also know that the sounds heal us. Each of the organs in our body and every cell in our body has a different frequency. And when you put them all together, our voice actually becomes the symphony and the personal signature of who we are. And there are not two people on the planet that have the same voice, okay? Because every cell in their body, all three tri trillion of them are operating on a different frequency. The most healing sound of all that we could possibly put into our body is the sound of the earth, and we call that OM. Now, just so you know, human hearts and brains, when stimulated by the OM vibration, are immediately triggering a healing response in every cell of the body. The sound of OM through a tuning fork used on specific points is almost like an IV treatment that immediately, without any delay, begins the healing process. The history and implications of, sound, of the sound of the spheres and its effects on the body is the most exciting technology that I've ever studied. Edgar Cayce, who was a great psychic, predicted over a half a century ago that sound would be the medicine of the future. Through sound, we alter the rhythmic pattern of our brain waves, our heart, and our respiration system. Now, we can also have a negative effect on that by listening to crummy music, but we can have a positive effect by using an own tuning fork. Every organ, bone, and tissue in the human body has its own separate frequency. Together, they make up a harmonic that is reflected in your aura and also in your voice. They, the heart and the aorta system vibrates between 7.8 and 6.8 hertz. Scientists at NASA have incorporated magnetic field generators into the space shuttles that sends a pulse of 7.8 hertz to the background signal so that it can maintain optimum health for our astronauts. Just as light holds every color, ohm holds every sound. The intelligence of the body uses the precise sound it needs to bring each organ to its proper frequency. Sound is a powerful force for healing, especially when used in a scientific manner. 